let's get into One Piece chapter 813. It is called An Invitation to the Tea Party. So we're going to find out more about the tea party that was going on in the last um, chapter, which was crazy. Okay, uh, so we got Crocus uh, here with Laboon from the Decks of the World, the 500 million man arc. Twin Cape, Laboon's having a whale of a time. That's funny. All right, next one. Let me full screen this thing. Huh? A, at a tea party? Nami's like, the shocking news brings a wave of unrest once more. Uh, Sanji's cigarette falls out of his mouth. Sanji's wedding, Chopper yells. Groom Vin Smock, Vin Smock. I don't know if it's Vin Smock or Vin Smoke, okay. Groom Vin Smock, family third son Sanji, with bride Charlotte, family 35th daughter Pudding. And then Capone's got the, the invitation right there. Sanji's just sitting. It shows his cigarette fall to the ground and sizzle on the floor. Capone's like, take it. Sanji's like, why now of all times? Capone's like, like I know what the hell's going on with your family. Brooks like, Sanji's a Vinsmok. It's a name that really sends a chill down my spine. But wait, it can't be. Can it? The freaking cigarette apparently is like burning on fire. Capone's like, what the? Hey, what the hell? Do you intend on burning my castle as well? Interesting. So that could be a little uh, tidbit right there. That fire affects his inside castle. Nami's like, hey Sanji, what's all this about? Chubby's like, are you getting married? Sanji's like, who the hell told them they could do something like this? Well, they're your relatives, but to think that you're from the Vinsmok family, they must have been some real terrible parents. <laughs> hey, bring me some wine. Yes, boss. Uh, Nami's like, Sanji's relatives? Come to think of it, though, Nolan the Liar. You ever, you heard of him? But it says here it's on loan from the, on loan from the North Blue. Yeah, well, I was born there. Whoa, that's news to me. I always thought you were from around here, too. I did grow up here, but it's not like it matters anyway. Um, Nami's like, we met Sanji in East Blue, but he did say something about his birthplace being in the North. Brooke, uh, she's like, I did think that was a little strange at the time. I don't know why that would be strange. I mean, the, the seas aren't that far off that they can, you know, travel through and through and through. Anyway, um, this dude's Brooke's like, yeah, but Nami-san, think about it. One would have to cross the red line to get from the North to East Blue. Okay, never mind. That is that is a little bit more difficult. Nami's like, I know. Brooks like, it's not so easy to pull off, crossing the entire sea and all. Just what kind of background does Sanji come from? Caesar's like, and hey, Charlotte's Big Mom's last name too. That bastard's getting wed to Big Mom's daughter. Chopper's like, ah, Sanji, are you going to be a part of a Yonko's family? Caesar's like, and if, we really, and if he really does wed her, you lot would automatically be a part of Big Mom's crew, or at least under her command. His Chopper's like, ah. Sanji's like, stop right there. I don't see why I'm obligated to go. This is ridiculous. Me getting married to a girl I've never met? <sighs> like the Straw Hat crew would go as low as going under your command. Our captain isn't someone who would just go under someone else's orders. He's the man that'll be one, that'll one day be the king of pirates. Capone's like, eh. That's all you have to say, isn't it? Oh, Sanji's like, that's all you have to say, isn't it? You can keep Caesar, but let us go. Ah! Caesar's like freaking out. Capone's like, I think you're mistaken. I just showed you the invitation, but I wasn't waiting for a yes or no from you. Either way, we're inside my body right now. So you will do as I say. All of you will come along with me to Mama. You probably don't feel it. We're actually moving right now. Huh? Gosh, you'll kill me. Please let me go. You're welcome to come try fight me, but don't forget, you're in my domain now. All the, um... Freaking silverware and stuff has turned into weapons. They're like cannons and stuff. Uh, the the floor has sunk and caused them to like um, it's like quicksand. Ah, wow, Nami's sinking. Nami san. Uh, everything in this castle is under my control. As you can see, I won't need to hurt you for you to go to the tea party. This is this is how things are in the new world. I was laughing. That's right. Mama hates it when there's bitter cakes and absentees at a tea party Reto. but if you don't turn up Reto, well you can regret and cry all you want but it won't help you Reto. so if there's an invitation for you to go to Big Mom's tea party Reto, you have to go whether you like it or not they say that even God would have to show up at her party if she wanted fire tank pirates consultant strange gun wit <laughs> interesting of course in the end it's all up to you Reto. but let me tell you something good Reto. he whispers something into his ear Sanji gets like ah 
looks at him like what everybody's like huh what's going on and he's the dude's kind of smiling Sanji lights up another cigarette how did you find out Capone's like what a funny question who do you think we are our master is one of the Yonko if she wanted someone dead they would have to die there's no need for intimidation Every time we talk to someone, their lives are at stake. And if you want to survive without going under someone else's command, you'd do best to not go against her. Sanji son, are you okay? What did they say to you? Chopper's like, oh. Sanji's like, give me a paper and pen. Leaving a note for Straw Hat, I see. <laughs> Sanji's writing down. He's got a smile on his face. Nami's like, huh? Please pass this to Luffy and the rest. Nami son. Chopper, Brooke, huh? Please just trust me on this. I didn't want to hide this from you guys. But I didn't think my past would catch up to me like this. I've got to put an end to this, end to all of this. Eh, you've got to go, you say. I feel a strong aura coming from outside. Must be someone from the Mink tribe. Are you ready? All the best, you guys. Go now! They all get thrown the hell out of this dude's castle. Uh, what is that? Brooke? Brooke kicks the shit out of this dude. Ah, he let his own friends get away, but he left me here. That bastard. Huh? Yeah? Don't blue, don't move or I'll blow this genius's brains out. So Sanji ended up grabbing one of the dude's guns and he's got freaking Caesar's head. He's got the gun up to his head. I remember this black leg. I finally got the whole picture. I know, I know you won't, I know you won't, you can't kill me. And you did say something about not even needing to put me in chains, didn't you? And the whole only alive crap on the wanted posters. Isn't it because it'd be pissed? Uh, isn't it because someone would be pissed off if I died? The only person that made the wanted posters like that is the same person that set this whole marriage thing up. What? Alright, hopefully they, they say what's going on. Four more pages. The only person that made the wanted posters like that is the same person that set this whole marriage up. Damn it, we've got to go out there and bring them back. Don't move, I'm warning you. I've got someone backing me right now, and you obviously know who. I'll follow you and your damn tea party to deal with all this, but leave my friends alone. All of you, stay where you are. Eh, yeah, but father, there's a monster out there right now. Oh shit, it's Nakamamura. Uh, Nak Nakamamoshi, that was his name. What the hell is that thing? Master, you shouldn't be moving so much. Oi, who might you lot be? Why is Peckham's all hurt like that? We're his comrades. Peckham's was betrayed by one of his own former crew. Sanji-kun, come out. Why are you still in there? Please tell us what's going on, Sanji. Nami's yelling. Let's wait for Luffy together, Sanji-san. Come out already. Nakamamushi is like, <clears throat> Sanji's like, this is my own problem. But I'll be back for sure. Say hi to them for me, okay? Nami's like, huh? They're all like, Sanji! This dude's castle tank, Sanji, Sanji-kun. His legs have turned into freaking armored treads. That's ridiculous. Wait, Nami, Chopper, don't you need to catch up with that guy? Oh, excuse me. It's Wanda jumps in. It's no use, Miss Wanda. Baron corpse. Nami lets the thing flood, uh, the little note fall down. Brooks like, even if we did catch up, I have a feeling he won't be coming back. To you bastards, gonna meet some girl, but I'll be back, Sanji. Just as they caught up with each other, they got to say their goodbyes again. Alright, so that was an interesting chapter. It was kind of a tease for... It was just a little bit more explanation of um, the actual that, you know, people were theorizing that the 35th daughter was Big Mom's daughter. Okay, we got confirmation of that. Um, we also got confirmation of how the rest of the Straw Hat crew was able to escape uh, from his body. Um, and also that the person that put together the... Um, wedding is in fact the one that made the wanted poster so either it's a fake wanted poster or um, the world government is involved the Marines are involved um, very interesting and that would be uh, I forgot who was in charge of it it was like commander something that's in charge of the wanted posters I don't know if he's in charge of all the wanted posters or just um, this one in particular or if it's somebody else entirely um, pretty decent chapter. I'm pretty sure we're going to be done with the flashbacks now. Sanji's flashbacks and we're just going to be getting into present arc. Uh, thanks for watching, liking, subscribing. As always, this is Periodic saying, see ya. Peace.